Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Windows 8, at some point in the future, we really don't know exactly when, uh, will be landing in real stores and virtual stores near you. If it's a virtual store near you, well, it's really, no, no, it's in front of you right now. It's the internet. It's a virtual store. You can go shopping for things. And uh, Windows 8 will be available. It's coming. You can't turn away from it. You can't say, no, I'm sticking with Windows 98 forever. There are some people who, who do believe that. It never got better than Windows 98 SE. I don't know who you are, really. I don't think you're watching our channel, but it, it could be. Who knows? I won't make fun of you uh, too much, really. But at least you're not on Millennium Edition or Vista. And let's hope that we're not ha ha looking uh, down the pike at uh, a, a, a repeat of uh, those versions of Windows. If you want to play with Windows 8 bits, not Windows 98, Windows 8, they drop the 9. If you want to start playing with it now, you can. You can download and install it in a virtual machine. And we've outlined three different ways you can play with Windows 8 today without ruining your current setup. Uh, take a look at the article. It's aptly titled, it's in the description, How to Install Windows 8 Developer Preview. Now, we are specifically doing this for people who are on a Mac in the hopes that maybe we could convince some of these Mac users out there to switch back to Windows outright. It's a possibility. So if you're on a Mac or if you're on Windows right now or... If you can run VirtualBox software, which is free, uh, you can try Windows 8 today. So we've outlined instructions. Number one, how to get the Windows 8 developer preview legally. Uh, two, uh, how to set it up in Boot Camp. Uh, three, Parallels 4, VMware Fusion 4, and five, VirtualBox. Now we talked about VirtualBox at, at times in the past. It is free software for you to use on pretty much any primary operating system you might have, Windows, Mac OS X, or, or Linux, and run a virtual machine. And the reason you use a virtual machine uh, is that uh, you wanted to try an operating system or you wanted to configure a certain type of operating system to do a certain amount of, uh, you know, for you, but not everything. It's like having a, a real PC running inside of your operating system. It's not emulation. It's a virtual machine, which means it can directly access the hardware, and that, that, Virtual machine thinks it's running on the computer outright. Like, there's nothing else. It's just it. It's, it's unto itself. It's a great way to test software. It's a great way to test operating systems. Now, keep in mind, though, that what we know of Windows 8 today is not likely what it's going to be in its final uh, edition. Uh, that being said, I remember looking at Vista thinking, this can't be it. And th that was it. Just the joke was on me. Uh, so, we, even though we've geared this towards uh, a lot of Mac users, the software, VirtualBox, is certainly available as well as Parallels and VMware Fusion, or not Fusion, but VMware Workstation is available on Windows, and certainly VirtualBox and VMware uh, are available on, on Linux. So, this could apply to anybody. If you want to try Windows 8 today, this is going to be the best. I would not recommend wiping out your current install of Windows. I would not recommend dual booting because you could destroy uh, the, the other, like your working copy of Windows. Don't do that. Run it inside a virtual machine, follow our directions, give it a shot. See if you like it. You might like it, you may not like it. But here's the thing again, don't pass judgment on beta software. This is a developer preview. It is not ready for prime time. But if you want to play around with stuff, I'm telling you, virtual machines are the best way to go. VirtualBox will run, uh, well, you know, in terms of what you want to do, it will run things just fine. So uh, there you go, a way to try Windows 8 right now on pretty much any operating system.